actually the first data set which you had informed me is DARPA 1998. Okay, for that you had informed uh, I have to uh, do several computation models. That models will be CNN and RNN. These two are train model and uh, decision tree and SPM or ML classification. Okay, so first I had, uh, I'm going to execute totally uh, three type of uh, files. This is big data. Th on this big data, we are using ML classifiers. Okay. That ML classifier will be not only I used decision tree and SPM, I used logistic regression and furthermore uh, data also. And then I am training the same data set by using CNN train model and RNN train model, which you had informed. So right now I am starting the execution here. It will take long time due to uh, the data set files uh, and we are importing Spark here. So that the reason it will took long time for the execution. I can't able to capture a video very fully that how it is executing everything. I just start up three files execution and I will show you the index pages. Once it is over, I will share you the screenshot so it will be easier to you to understand. First, I am going to share you for this data set. If you approve, then I will share you the remaining two files. No problem. So first, I am going to execute this big data file. So in this big data file, we are processing these things. So in your projects, you ask me, these are all the variations you ask that what will, what will be the percentage of U2R and R2L and DOS attacks. In the image you had displayed uh, to calculate for this by using this data set, I need to calculate U2R, R2L, PROB and DOS attack and find accuracy, precision recall, F measure based on the algorithm, the plot graph. This was the requirement you informed on this particular data set. So based on that only I, I am predicting. First we are segregating the attack types and counts here. Based on that we are providing you the graph. Okay. So you can see here uh, the dependency of the flags and the attack types what uh, which you had informed. So based on that the same manner only for example so the blue color will be uh, this color DOS attacks so uh, based on here uh, these are all the types of uh, flags on this flag the DOS will be this much percentage prob will be this much percentage and also the prototype based on the protocols in the attack types based on this okay so uh, we are using here the protocol will be ICMP TCP and UDP so based on this protocols, how much DOS attack and prob attack are to L, URL and normal. We are segregating the difference. On the same basis only here also the service type. These are all the service types are available in the data set. Based on that DOS, prob, R to L, U to R and normal. How much percentages. So we are calculating a complete flow that which you had in, informed me. And also here you may see the accuracy precision recall F measure values for uh, the types of logistic regression, a random forest, uh, SVM as well as decision tree. For these four types we had import, uh, we had uh, processed here by using big data process. Okay. Then the remaining two I am going to execute by using next to console itself. I started to execute the CNN train models and also I started to execute RNN also here. CNN and RNN will take a huge timings. So, so you may see here based on the prototype what type of flag based on ICMP, based on TCP, based on UDP. 
what will be and uh, here also i have imported the accuracies for the logistic regression based i am calculating here 0 1 2 and 3 four classes totally based on u 2 r and r um, the things which we had already imported now so based on that i converted into the class name and based on that what will be the accuracies for uh, these are all the algorithms and once it is over it started to a uh, training sessions okay here i am calculating the accuracies once for the training as well as testing, you inform me 80% will be the training and 20% will be the testing. Based on that, we segregate the data set values and then the CNN training will be start up here. So then I started the execution of RNN here. Okay, for CNN is on process, it's executing. So right now I started the execution of RNN. So it informing the data set values, everything, and it provide you the plots also based on that. So I'm segregating here based on uh, flag prototypes and services and uh, overall uh, the part of uh, data set, how much has been trained and testing everything we are calculating. And then finally it will calculate with RNN and it will provide you the result. So loading time will be take high. 